Hi guys and welcome back to our channel. So we've been traveling for a while now and we've decided to put together a few travel tips that has been helping us for all the times that we've been traveling and I hope this helps you guys also. So here goes our travel tip Thursday. The first one we're looking at would be uh, booking your holiday and I know that a lot of planning goes into booking a holiday and there are three main things that we look at or look for when booking our holidays and the first one is transport. The second one is accommodation and the last one is things to do. So when looking at transport, I think the first thing I always factor in is the cost. Um, we look at the different ways of getting to our destination, uh, whether it's for the flight, trains or even using a car. And I've read that the best time to book flights are on a Tuesday. And honestly, I have tried this and I've got some pretty good deals on, on booking flights. Uh, but that's if you want to get to a place quite quick. If you're not so much in a hurry and you like a bit of a longer trip and a very scenic route, then I, I suggest you opt for a train. Like we've taken trains to Scotland before because the route there is very scenic. And lastly, using your car. Uh, I think if you have larger families or bigger groups, then using a car would be good. Also, if you don't mind driving and you like a very long drive, then uh, using your car is a good option for you. And the next thing we're looking at is accommodation. Accommodation is a very big factor for me. I will honestly look at the condition of a place before I actually book it. And don't get me wrong, I do always look for a good deal and a good price on something. And that's why we have the perfect offer for you. So if you love to travel but are always worried about the price of, of accommodation, then we have a solution for you. We are affiliated with Booking.com and are able to get you some great deals. Follow the link in the description below for exclusive offers on hotels, holiday homes and so much more. We have been using Booking.com for almost 8 years now and have always found amazing places to stay at very good prices so check them out. Alright and the final thing we look at uh, on our holiday or when booking a holiday are things to do because you don't just want to go to a place and not have an itinerary. So I know this may seem very overrated but when visiting a place for the first time we tend to always check out the tourist spots first. This gives us a very good indication of the place, of the people, of the culture and even the history behind the place and it makes you feel closer uh, to whoever or wherever you are visiting. Museums are a very good option if you are uh, interested in history or the science behind an area and that can be followed by restaurants that serve local foods. You also learn a lot about culture by the food that you eat. And if you have a lot of time, then go out for a walk around the town. It gets you a chance to look at the locals and to learn more about the culture. Or just grab a drink at a local bar or pub. You find that the friendliest people could be at the bar, bars or pubs. So I hope these tips have helped you and they have been a part of planning our holidays over the years and have been a big help to making our adventures more exciting and more productive. So please don't forget to like and subscribe and join us every Thursday for our travel tips.